Hello, you are welcome. How to solve for A in this nice exponent problem? From here, we have 27 raised to power A minus 9 raised to power A equals to 3 raised to power A. Then from here, let's change this to base 3 and this will be 3 raised to power 3, that's 27. So, and raised to power A then minus 3 square then raised to power a equals to 3 raised to power a and from here on the law of indices what we have a raised to power m raised to power n is same thing as a raised to power m n and then which is also same thing as a raised to power n then raised to power m so we can interchange this power now and this becomes 3 raised to power a then raised to power 3 minus 3 raised to power a then raised to power 2 which is equals to 3 raised to power a from here then here 3 raised to power a is common so let's use a letter to represent that let u be equals to 3 raised to power a and this equation becomes u cube minus u square then equals to u then let's bring everything to one side to form a cubic equation so we have u cube minus u square minus u now equals to zero so from here we can factor u since u is common when we factor u out we have u into bracket what is left here u square minus what is left here u then minus one then equals to zero so two cases here are u equals to zero and uh, the next we have u square minus u minus one is equals to zero so on this side well we recall that u is three to power a equals to zero so this is not possible here so there won't be a solution here so no solution on this side then for this side now when we solve this quadratic formula using quadratic formula we have u equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and here a is the coefficient of u square that's one then b is minus 1, coefficient of u, c is a constant, minus 1. So we have u now equals to minus, minus 1, plus or minus square root of, minus 1 square, minus 4a, then c, minus 1. Then, we have over 2 times 1. So from here, we have u now to be equals to 1, that's minus times minus as 1, plus or minus square root of, we have 1 plus 4 now, then over 2. So here we have u equals to 1 plus or minus square root of 5 over 2. Here we have two possible values of u. First, we have u equals to 1 plus root 5 over 2 and also we have u equals to 1 minus root 5 over 2 then recall that u is 3 raised to power a so we have 3 raised to power a here equals to 1 plus root 5 over 2 then here let's take the log on both sides then we have log 3 raised to power a equals to log 1 plus root 5 over 2 then here applying the power law a come to the back we have a log 3 then equals to log 1 plus root 5 over 2 from here then we can divide both sides by log 3 then divide this side as well by log 3. Log 3 cancels out here. We have a left. So then a now equals to log 
when we use the law of logarithm to separate this we have log 1 plus root 5 then minus here we have log 2 then divided by log 3 so here we have the value of a on this side then when we look at this side now u is 3 raised to power a and uh, we say it's equals to 1 minus root 5 over 2 here and when you look at this this is positive and this will be a negative number so this will not be equal to each other and hence we say there is no solution on this side so no solution as well on that side so the only solution here is a equals to log 1 plus root 5 minus log 2 then over log 3 and here we have come to the end of this class and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more exciting videos turn on the notification bell share this video give it thumbs up see you next class then bye for now